try to take you through how you can fare withholding tax return. So withholding tax return is basically tax which is usually withheld from the source. For individual withholding tax return, no audit is required, but for companies, you require an external auditor to audit the withholding tax return. But basically what you're supposed to do, just get into the iTax portal, then hit enter. So then just choose Kenya Revenue Authority portal, then head into it. So what you just need to do, just enter your KRA pin here and then hit continue. In case you have forgotten your KRA password, you just need to hit forgot. Then you just need to enter some security stamp. It's just a simple computation which you just need to do, which is here. So I have 142 plus 18, which is basically 160. Yeah, you just need to enter here, then hit login. So you shall get into your, either your client uh, uh, interface of the KRA. So what you need to do, you just need to come to where we have payment. Then get where we have payment registration. After getting to where we have payment registration, you just need to click yes. Then you, yeah, next, then you'll be asked if you want to proceed, just hit OK. So when you proceed, all this data will be populated, your client tax payer name, your PIN and uh, some details. So you just need to choose your, you just need to choose your tax head. So my tax head is uh, income tax. You, you then need to choose your tax subhead. So my tax subhead is income tax for withholding. So basically for withholding tax, you just need uh, to, you are required to have filed it in the 20th date of the subsequent month in the next month. So it is due in uh, June 20th, 2025, in, in basically because we are in 2025. So you are supposed to file it before or by 20th of the next month. So it is here. So from there, what you need, you need to do, you just need now to use, instead of using by using Excel upload, which can be complicated to fill, just choose by web form. So by web form is just simple, even for non-professional in the, in this, in tax matters. So what you need to do, just choose the nature of the transaction, the nature of transaction, just choose uh, management professional training and consultancy fee which is over, over, in over one month. So from there, now you just need to choose the withholding, the date of payment with Hodi. So the date of payment with Hodi is usually in the, in the, in the, in the withholding certificate. So it's usually here. This is the day. So it is 27th November 2024. So just fill it here. So this is due since the date have been by, been bypassed, but you feeling it by 20th of the subs, of the next month, the subsequent month. So it's 27th of November, 2024. Then we have the with pin. So don't make a mistake. The withholding P, pin is usually here. So the with pin is the pin of the, of the individual who is withholding, who is withholding that tax. So the with Sorry, I'm having an internet problem here. Let me fix it for a minute and then we get back to the video. So it is here. So the withholding pin is usually is this one is the pin of the withholder of the tax, which is here is usually here. So where we have the withholding pin, fill this pin. Let me fill the pin here. Let me get back into the portal and fill my pin here. So the pin is uh, that fill your pin. Let me fill mine, which is P, P050, P052, P052, 043, P052, 043, 043, 9, and to L, let me confirm is it is the same. So it's P520 439 4043 L. So after filling it, let me get back into the interface. 
the details of the withhold D will be filled here automatically. You don't need to fill anything. Then from there, from there you just need to put your gross amount in the withholding certificate. So my gross amount is here. So I just need to enter it here of 55,000, which is here. After inputting it, I just need to select the nature of the resident. I have forgotten as a resident. Then uh, I just need to to enter. Let me let me scroll a bit down. So I just need to let me do an adjustment here. You can wait for it to become responsive. So let me fix my internet. So let me wait. I know it's responsive. I ring an error here. Today is uh, many people in the portal. So let us give it time and wait it to respond. Yeah, now it have responded. So after responding, you can see now, uh, as I have shown you, you enter the amount. So immediately you enter the amount, the tax rate will be input here, which is of 5%. So in case you are doing it for professional training and consultancy fee, the tax rate, the tax withhold is 5% of the amount, is the 5% of 55,000, which is 27,50. And after doing this, now you can select the mode of payment if you, are, you need to pay. So the mode of payment, you can choose this one or other payment. So this is this is uh, the other mode of payment is either you want to pay through cash and pesa or but this another one is if you want to pay through bank so and after doing this you can hit submit so you are post to uh, please check the disclaimer box so i have forgotten to read the disclaimer so you can read this disclaimer and uh know about the act and then he submit so you are told the amount must be greater than zero okay so already had done this i was trying if i can do it uh, using zero so you just need to input the total amount to be paid here and after entering the total amount to be paid then hit submit and then hit continue so i already had made the payment i was doing it for just demonstration purposes and this is how we usually do withholding return using the kra portal using as very simple steps so in case even you want to do the withholding tax for other incomes like dividends and uh, so on and so forth what you need to do let me show you here let me show you in case you have other nature of transaction maybe is for ordinary dividends you can select here if it's for ordinary dividends so you can see the rate have automatically changed to 10 percent so you can do any any withholding tax return using this format and this is the method which we usually use so it is for by 20th of the subsequent month so thank you for watching and almighty god bless you and when you are through just remember to